G'day, Dan Palmer here, founder, creator, and curator of the Making Permaculture Stronger blog and podcast. And I am writing a book, a book about my 15 years of experience as a professional permaculture designer. A book with practical examples of what I've learned by asking deep questions about what healthy design process looks like. A book sharing my conversations and collaborations with permaculture design colleagues from around the world. A book sharing practical examples in detail of how I have worked as a designer on specific projects. Now I'm really excited to share that I'm working with an incredible team. First I'd like you to meet Hanata, our amazing illustrator. Hi all, my name is Hanata Siegerman. Now let's meet James. Hi everyone, my name's James and I am the editor for this book project. And Hanata, would you explain how you got involved in the project? I was in an amazing journey in New Zealand. I was traveling and working on farms, learning about sustainable living and permaculture, self-sufficiency. And back then I was keeping a visual diary where all my learnings would end up there and I was using watercolor and, and then saw, uh, he saw this work. So since then we are collaborating together. And James, why are you involved in the project? I'm involved because there's all this great materials being accumulating on this blog and it's time it was pulled out of the back blocks of the internet and put in front of your beautiful eyeballs. It's too good not to share. Oh David, oh hello, did you want to say something about the book? I think it's very exciting that the dynamic blog Making Permaculture Stronger is giving birth to a book. So here we are, this potent team. If this project resonates with you, if you see the value to developing and evolving permaculture design in deeper, richer and more beautiful directions, we would be so grateful for your support. And given Hanada's from Brazil, let's hear it in Portuguese. É, então muito, muito obrigado pelo pelo suporte, pelo apoio. E e a gente se vê por aí.